Okay, hopefully this is a quick and simple video to show how to get around a limitation in Figma's prototyping features. Uh, they don't allow you to have a hover over on an object or something you have on the screen uh, and also be able to click on it. So you can have one action effectively. So if I click on the prototype mode, and actually I can just click off everything so you can see where I'm going with everything. Um, you can see I have my original frame with my original object and while hovering over it takes me to the uh, second one, green. And I have this one set to on click take me to this third one, which the third one is set to mouse leave. And so if you move your mouse off of this, it'll pop all the way back to the original. And so to prove this all works correctly, let's go to the prototype. I'm going to bring my mouse on, on, off, on, off. If I go on and then click, I'm taking to the click item. And if I move my mouse off this, I'm right back to my default again. And everything is reset and ready to go again. So again, I can put my mouse on and off. I can click again and then take my mouse off. That should accomplish what most people want to do with this. Although it's going to be painful in that if you had, let's say, a, uh, a row of menu items at the top of the page and you wanted each one to have these same abilities, you'd have to have, let's say, there was five at the top and you had uh, um, uh, five different things you wanted to hover over and click on. It'd be five times three, so you'd have to have 15, uh, effectively 15 objects or 15 frames if you want to.